I once had somebody, you know, making this quote that if it was easy, everybody was going to do it. But to show that it's not easy, not everybody is doing it. Allow me to tell you, when Abraham was called, it was him alone. And let me tell you, when he was called, it was not a matter of him asking for an approval from his family and being called to go to another land. Can I go? Can I? No, 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 no. You must understand that when you hear the voice of the Lord, it talks to you alone. And the fact that it talks to you alone, it means whatever you have to do, only you alone will understand. Moses alone saw the burning bush and he went closer. The problem comes when we start to want to make people see what we see. And let me tell you, the fact that you can see that thing, you, see, you alone can see that big vision. It means something special. Or else, if everybody of you could see it, every one of you would do it. So the fact that only you can see there and everyone else is disagreeing, it's special on its own. That is why only you can do it. Only your eyes that the Lord has opened to see that well of water, to see what you can achieve, to see how to do it successfully. Your eyes, do not doubt your eyes. I know it is common to want to share with people around, but remember this one thing. If you ever to slip up, you share and they disagree, they discourage you, but you can see the bigger picture. Remember this word. Do it. Don't wait for them. Do it. You can see it. Do it. And you will see now when you are done, you'll be like, huh? Didn't I tell you so? And now they'll say, oh, wow. How do you do it? That is you. Your eyes. Trust your eyes. I pray for you further. Let God anoint and open up your eyes to see beyond and achieve the impossible. Things that nobody else can achieve. May you achieve the extraordinary. I pray over you right now in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. And of course, that's all I had. My details are on the comment section below. See you next time.